Ooh, what's up, Internet? Corey Zamir here. Collecting with Corey. It is time to start the weekly vlog. And for the first time in a long time, we're starting off right on Monday. In a good mood. Had a good day at work. Got a lot of shit done. Got two schedules done. So I do the schedule at work. And didn't really deal with anybody's bullshit, which is always a plus. Uh, the other thing I'm excited about is I'm actually about to go home and I'm going to film the over 1,000 subscriber contest that has been long overdue seeing as I'm at 1,300 subscribers right now and I've been meaning to do it since I hit 1,000 but I kept trying to convince myself that I needed more uh, to give you guys uh, as far as a prize because I've already given out a top loader before, an NES top loader. But when it comes down to it, if you think about contests for other uh, video game, retro video game YouTubers, it doesn't really get much better than a top loader. So giving out a second one is pretty damn good. Uh, so be sure to check that video out. It would have posted on Wednesday of last week. This week that I'm living right now. I actually haven't even filmed it yet. I actually don't even know what question I'm going to ask you guys how to enter. So be sure to check that video out. I should have a link down in the description below. I'm probably going to have it running for about two weeks. Give you guys some time to enter, some time to check that out. And get back to me with whatever video response. Holy shit. I hate bikes. I hate bikers. Like actual bike bicyclists. So fucking annoying. Just almost took my fucking window off or my uh, side view mirror off with this fucking bike. You saw that. It was live. And definitely just had my butthole pucker thinking that that cop was coming for me. So, <laughs> let's just get home in one piece. God damn. Alright guys, bad lighting should soon be over as I'm getting the fuck out of this car. Heading into my old, old middle school to vote. I don't know where to go. The first time I've had to vote in this school. It used to be at my old elementary school, but they closed that down for an office building, so I'm gonna go vote. I guess. Not excited about it. Just been kind of paying slightly uh, not close attention to the politics behind it, but you can't help but see it. So, let's get in there. Hey guys, I haven't really taken the time to vlog all that much this week. Uh, actually just kind of stumped on what to talk about. Like obviously the election just happened and we all know the outcome. And I'm honestly all talked out about that from work. And I, politics is not really one thing I want to talk about on my YouTube channel, to be honest. So, yeah, I'm actually making a sandwich right now because I'm starving in D&D slash watching Ash vs. the Evil Dead, hopefully, is still like three hours away. But I'm just going to make myself a sandwich, a... 
ham and cheese, honey ham and cheese sandwich. That was actually the same thing I had for breakfast this morning. Alicia and I are going to be trying to, I know, I, I feel like I'm a broken record like with what we said in the past. Uh, we're going to be trying to cut back on our ridiculous going out to eat like way too much on the weekends and coming up to the weekends too. Like I know tomorrow, <clears throat> I actually wonder how the sound's working on this. Like half of this I'm facing you guys, half of this I'm walking away because I'm, I don't know. I'm a terrible vlogger. What can I say? Um, tomorrow and Saturday night, we're actually going over to our best friend's house for dinner. So that's cool. We're having tacos tomorrow. And I think she said pizza for Saturday. Which is pretty cool. Her best friend's long distance boyfriend finally moved up to Connecticut. So he's pretty cool. He's a quarry also. Um, I mean, I am the coolest Corey, but he, he's, he's, he's a good second. Um, yeah, so I don't know if I'd vlog over there. Still have, like, vlogging anxiety about, like, vlogging. Not so much vlogging in public, but vlogging around people that I don't know would have a problem being on a YouTube video, you know? Like, very specifically, you know how Alicia reacts. I don't know how other people will. Like, like, I know a lot of people in the video gaming community around here are okay with it. Like, Sam's okay with it. Ariel's okay with it. Short list. I don't know. Like, like there's a lot of people that I could get on the vlog slash the YouTube. Slash any of my YouTube shows that they're, they would be relevant for. But, like, I don't know how they'd react. You know? And I just feel like that's an awkward conversation to have with people. Like, it's one of those things where a lot of people around here, I don't even think, no, I do YouTube. And, like, part of that is by design. Because I figured the last thing I needed to do was get collecting more popular in Connecticut by showing you, like, hey, look at this thrift store that's fucking popping. Look at this thrift store that's fucking popping. So, like, for a long while, my target audience is basically anybody into retro gaming and collecting that doesn't live near me. And, you know, you're going to have some splash damage. You're going to get some people that are right around the corner that are now going to those spots a lot more frequently than I ever did. And every once in a while they hit gold and I see it on Facebook and I'm a little bit salty, but at the same time, if you're willing to put the effort in, I myself, I don't complain because I don't put the effort in for thrifting anymore, I'll be honest with you guys. We pretty much hit thrift stores once a week and usually the same two. Like the thrift store that's down the street from my house has been street trash for... A year now well, well the last thing that was found there I think was the Tales of Legendia game for the PS2 so whenever that video happened that was like the last time it was good um, I, I very highly suspect that one of the employees there probably the one that wears all the video game anime manga uh, popular TV show um, pins and shit all over his vest. I'm assuming he's the one that's probably the cause. Not exactly a conversation I'd want to have with him, just because it's kind of awkward. That and Goodwills, I think, are probably shipping stuff off to, like, their eBay stores or whatever. Because you know, you know how Goodwill has their own, like, eBay auction site kind of thing, so... Yep, I feel like that's kind of the culprit. That and people just becoming more aware of what they have. That's my sandwich in all of its glory. Which I'm about to enjoy while I edit yesterday's weekend adventure, which I still have yet to edit on Thursday. So I wish me luck. I'd be hanging from my rope or something, but... Yeah. But she does post things about anxiety and depression. Yeah. Oh, okay.
Stop and shop, picking up breakfast food, some cheese and a ton of bacon. I'm gonna be making egg sandwiches and, well, bacon, egg, and cheese sandwiches, I guess. Uh, let me know how your week is going. Let me know how you're dealing with this whole election bullshit. I don't care who you voted for. Facebook has become. A disaster like I've just been unfollowing people to be honest because it's not worth my time to even get upset about what people are saying and like just the arguing going back and forth just not worth it so like the video subscribe if you're new as always keep it real internet kind of a weird thumbs up but that's all I got for you e to the e to the e man. Wait a, wait a